What's up everyone welcome back to another video and this video I'm gonna talk about how to fix blurry text font on a Windows 11 and how we can fix this app. So we need to get into this step. So the first step for most step just go over here search for the settings over here click on the settings and right now we need to go over here in the system and right now navigate to the display and right now what we need to do is we have to scroll down and we have to check the first one that's for the scale and you have to expand this up and as you can see we have options like 100 percentage 125 percentage and we have 150 percentage so you can select the recommended one so based on my my monitor it is 100 percentage it's what recommended so i have to select this one and go for the display resolution as well and over here i have selected the 16900 because that is what it's recommending for me mine is not having a very high graphics so i have to select this one and this is what we have to do as the first and foremost step cross checking should be done and once afterwards what we need to do is we just need to move to the next one next one is all about just go over here search for over here you have to search here for Clarity over here, you can just search over like this. So we'll be getting this adjust clear type text. Open this one, the first one, and also make sure that you have to put a check on this one, turn on clear tape. And right now, go for the next. And right now, you have to make sure it is setting up to the Windows resolution. So in my case, it is Dell E260H. So go for next. Now from here, I'm going to have a set of five questions. And from this, I have to select which one is perfectly fine for me because I have to read and get a complete accurate on the text how to read it how to see it and right now if i check over here this is kind of blurry but this looks actually fine so i have to select this one and i have to move to the next one over here i looks this is fine for me because it is very accurate and fine so i'm going to select this one as well or i have to go for this one so let me select this one and go for next and right now i'm going to select this one that is also fine for me and i'm going to select over here yeah, i'm going to select this one and go for the next and once it is done you have to go for this one and i'm going to select next and it is set and go for finish so that it's been set into your display i mean to the monitor and once afterwards just go over here search for the run command like this and you have to go over here and this time we have to type sys dm.cpl and that's what we have to type and go for ok and right now go for the advanced go for settings and right now in the set thing over here you have to make sure it is on the custom and you have to put a check on only the animations in the taskbar show shadows under the windows this should be unchecked and you have to click on show thumbnails instead of icon smooth edge of the screen fonts and these three things should be selected rest everything can be removed and once afterwards you have to check with the still if you're having the shape still if there you just need to go over here search for the registry editor over here and we need to go for yes and right now over here as you can see very previously i have done one step over here which is going to take you to this but this is not how it looks like i need to ex just check everything over here and i'm going to expand this up and i'm going to remove everything over here and i'm going to keep it like this and the what i'm going to do is from here the first and foremost step we need to make in a backup because we're going to make a few changes over here so just click on the file over here and click on the export over here or you can create a backup once the backup is successfully created you're fine with it and what we need to do just go over here for the h key current user and what we need to do is we just need to go for the control panel over here and we need to click on this one and right now from here we need to select the desktop and from here we need to select win 8 over here we have to select this one windows metrics over here we have to select this one and i think from here we need to select one thing called wind 8 over here or you can go for this one or you can just expand this up over here so right now you have to expand the desktop and right now what we need to do is or you can just click on the desktop itself and if you scroll down just click on the desktop and you don't have to do expanding like this you don't have to do like this. just click on the desktop and right now we can see we have one thing called win 8 dpi scaling over here we need to right click on this one and you can see the value is being set into zero you have to change the value to one and make sure it is on the hexadecimal and go for ok and right now we need to create a string over here as well right click on this one go for the new create d word of the word 32 bit value and right now we need to give this particular one we need to rename it as it is so what we need to do we just need to go for log over here you have to type p should be capital type pixels over here and the value should be given 78 and once you create this one right click on this one and this particular value should be given 78 and you have to go for okay and once afterwards you have to check most probably these can help you guys out and if you find this video helpful don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more notification see you soon in the next video peace out bye bye